Hi, I'm Mike Hughes, and today we're going to go over how to get your horses dry in a hurry if you need to. For example, if you're at a horse show and you, you know you bathed your horse, but they're just not drying in time, and now you have to go warm up your horse or show them. Um, or you know, perhaps it's a really rainy day, but you've got a little bit break in the weather, and your horses are wet, and you really want to put a blanket on them because tomorrow is going to be a really um, you know wet day, and it's going to be really cold in the morning. And, you know, your horses may be trace clipped or body clipped, or you just got done working your horse, you know, and it's in the evening because it's the only time you have to really work them. They're a little sweaty, so you really want to get them dry before you put the blanket on them. And this technique is also going to be a really great desensitizing uh, technique for your horse, but it also works if you really want to get your horses dry in a hurry. So before you go through this, you want to make sure you go through all the desensitizing that we have on our member page, and you want to go through all the desensitizing on uh, getting this done. And the way we're going to do it today is we're going to act like it's a water hose. Alright, that's, that's the way we're going to do it. We're going to act like it's a water hose. You know, the horses are afraid of the water hose. You know, we want to squirt it right here, then on this side, this side. Then eventually we'll go up the front legs, to the neck, to the shoulders, to the rib cage, and to the hind end. So Shasta here has already been desensitized. She's a pretty calm, relaxed horse. You know, not too much bothers her, but, um, you know, you'd want to go through all your desensitizing first. So, here's how we're going to do it. And you could do this anywhere that has an extension cord. So, we're going to grab <coughs> what we call here, we're going to grab here what we call a leaf blower. And, you know, in a leaf blower, it blows out a lot of good air. So, in the beginning, what we're going to want to do is we're just going to want to turn it on. We want to turn her off and see how she reacts. Then we're going to turn it back on again. And then we want to blow it around on each side of her and probably go up her hind legs. The one thing I'm not going to want to do is I'm not going to want to put it down here and blow it because it's going to blow all the dust and stuff up into her face, so I wouldn't want to do that. So I'm going to ask Shasta to back up here a little bit, and I'm going to turn it back on, and this time I'm going to start at her legs, her front legs, I'm going to go up to her chest, her hind, you know, her shoulders, her rib cage, and if she starts moving, then I could always do the change of direction or do a one rein stop with her and kind of start over at that point. So I'm going to go ahead and switch hands here. I'm going to go ahead and turn it on. she was wet, you'd be able to get this done within 20-25 minutes easily with the uh, leaf blower here. So it's a great way to really get your horses desensitized. As you can see, Shasta doesn't care too much about this because we've done so much desensitizing with her before. 
and as you can see, it's probably a great way to get all the dust off them if you want to the dust off them all of a sudden. And it's a great way to get them dry if you want to put the winter blanket on in the winter time, but they're still wet, or if you're in the show ring, or before you go to the show ring, you know, just a little wet, you get them dry in a hurry. So I hope this helps, and have a great time with your horses. Thank you.